At least a dozen witnesses have testified in Congress as part of the House's impeachment inquiry. Stop tape. Why haven't we heard from those dozen witnesses, Mr. Schumer? Why are the American people being filtered evidence, if you will, or testimony uh, through the hands and through the greasy fingers of Adam Schiff? Why aren't we allowed to see these people as they testify and see them as they're questioned by the Democrats, Adam Schiff and company, and the Republicans? Why can't we see this? Why aren't we allowed to see this? Why is Adam Schiff cherry-picking information to be released? Now he's released a couple of transcripts. Well, what about the other transcripts? And, again, to point out, the transcripts are not like a live human being. Transcripts don't show pauses, for example. Transcripts don't sm show smiles or, or frowns and things like this. The American people should be allowed to see these people who are testifying ostensibly against the president of the United States. They're witnesses for the prosecution, uh, if you will. And we certainly should be allowed to see the identity of the whistleblower, although we believe we know who it is, and he's a partisan hack. And now this guy, by the way, says, oh, yeah, I'll testify, but I'll only testify in writing. Uh, right. Again, it's a sham. The president's being railroaded. And Adam Schiff is cherry-picking witnesses and testimony to feed the mainstream media, and the mainstream media simply regurges Tate's whatever Adam Schiff says, and voila, you have a story, and voila, you have polls indicating that they believe more and more that impeachment is proper. This is a predetermined outcome that's being rolled out in the House of Representatives. Still, though, it's a complete and total political process, and I don't know if Nancy Pelosi is ever going to allow it to be a full-blown impeachment. I don't know if there will ever be a full vote in the House of Representatives uh, on impeachment, unless the polling reflects green lights in key swing states. If they don't, and right now they're against impeaching the president and removing him from office. So unless those change, I do not believe that Nancy Pelosi will ever allow a full vote of the House of Representatives on impeachment. And of course, uh, that would mean Chuck Schumer doesn't get his greasy fingers on an impeachment trial. Roll tape. The facts that are already in the public record are troubling and require further investigation. Stop tape, how do we know this? Again, it's being filtered through Adam Schiff. And you know the amazing thing to me on this one is why the mainstream media is not up in arms over the fact that they're not being allowed into these hearings so they can report what's going on, so they can see these witnesses ostensibly on behalf of the American people. Why isn't the mainstream media asking Nancy Pelosi, why are you conducting impeachment in an unprecedented way in the House of Representatives? Un unprecedented because it's being uh, achieved in the Intel Committee. It's supposed to be, per congressional precedents, in the Judiciary Committee. But no, we have Adam Schiff in the Intel Committee taking point on impeachment, but we also know there are several other committees uh, going to be involved, including Maxine Waters' Finance Committee. So Maxine Waters is finally getting what she wanted all these two years of the Trump presidency when she's been calling for impeachment. She's finally getting what she wants, and she's gonna be part of the process. Isn't that wonderful? It's an amazing story here then the dots are not being connected on behalf of the mainstream media for the American people. It's, it's, it's truly unbelievable that they're ignoring, the mainstream media are, what has gone on here, and that is the call for impeachment virtually from day one when Donald Trump was sworn into office, and they finally got what they think is phony evidence to perpetuate the impeachment. But think about what the Democrat Party did during 2016, and these folks are so worried about foreign corruption, these people brought foreign corruption on the 2016 election cycle through the phony dossier and other methods of working with foreign adversaries to try and defeat President Trump, then candidate Trump. Biggest scandal in the history of this republic, and this is a smokescreen to try and cover what is gonna come out of the Department of Justice 
which is an investigation of the biggest scandal in the history of this republic. So Schumer, Schumer should go down in history as one of the lead political hacks who attempted to politically assassinate the 45th president. And if this sham impeachment railroad makes a stop in the Senate for this train, well, then rest assured that the snake from New York will do everything in his power to get weak Republicans like Mitt Romney to hop on board as the assassinated President Trump Express rolls straight toward a date with American political infamy. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One American News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One American News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.